Gotta ask your thoughts though, man. Police killings. You know, it's kind of gotten a little rampant this year. Mm. How do you feel about what's been going on and how the propaganda and how the media's been portraying it as of yet? Yeah, man. Um, it's, it's a long time has been a crisis in our community of uh, our lives not being valued. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, um, it's, and the police is just the front line of the status quo mm -hmm. staying in place. You know what I mean? And um, too many families, too many moms, too many people that lost their children. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Unarmed and just, it's beyond even an epidemic. You know what I mean? It's a war. You know what I mean? It's a it's an outright war. And it's the lack of um, organization in our own community that allows that to keep happening. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's one thing to say, you know, we know it's terrorism coming from the police force on our people, but it, it continues to happen um, because, you know, of the disunity and the disorganization. So I think um, for me, for a long time, you know, we, you know, we've been trying to do proactive things, you know, to, to help bring about some organization and unity and uh, self-defense right. and value, and, you know, in the community. Um, and I think now more and more people, because it's just ridiculous mm -hmm. to the next level, more people are motivated, you know, and, and looking for solutions. Um, and it's a complex issue. So, um, but the first thing is we got to care. That's right. You know what I mean? We got to we got to actually care. And then I think we can figure out, you know, ways to uh, shield ourselves, you know, you know, so we working on it. On the 20th anniversary of the Million Man March, I mean, how did you feel about the 10, 10, 15, man? Mm. Well, you know, I've been kind of like uh, learning from brothers and sisters who like are knee deep in it. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I, I didn't stay too uh, right up on it, you know what I mean? To say I'm, I'm, I'm in support yeah. of the, you know, the uh, justice or else. Mm -hmm. I think that we have to be the or else, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And I think, um, cause we know ain't no justice. So, uh, you know, whatever the or else is, is what we gonna do. Yeah. And I think um, it's, it's not about just reacting mm -hmm. to tragedies, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? But it's putting movements in place that prevent things like that, you know what I mean? Um, it, case in point, a lot of the work I do is, uh, is around holistic health and, mm -hmm. and uh, well-being, right? And I, I feel like that's the front lines. Um, and, you know, we talk about the police murders, right? You yeah. know, and for however many um, of us have lost our lives from police, thousands and thousands more we lose our lives from diabetes. Mm and hamburgers mm -hmm. and cigarettes yeah. and lifestyle choices right now i i don't i'm not but i don't want to belittle you know anything that we doing to get the police off us because that's absolutely necessary and that's all right but what i want to say if we saying black lives matter mm -hmm. right then the lives matter yep. it don't matter if it's the police or the or the mcdonald's mm -hmm. Or, you know what I mean, or the, the cool cigarette, yep. you know what I mean, if black lives matter, then let's, that, or else, let's start acting like our lives matter, yep. and be the kings and the G's that we was born to be, and the queens that we was born to be. I can definitely dig it. I mean, the workout album, though, tell me about it, I mean, back on my regimen, blood pumping, man, mm, tell me about that right there. <laughs> Yeah, man, now, the workout album for me was a, is definitely a, a paradigm shift. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I, I've been through a whole lot in, in, in with Dead Prez and mm -hmm. traveling and learning and just trying to grow, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And having the opportunity to, to focus on my growth, mm -hmm. being an artist, you know what I mean? Everybody don't have that time, yeah. you know what I mean? And um, I, I learned that some of the, the, the things that I was feeling some of the things that I was saying and the way I was going about it as a teenager mm -hmm. was teenage shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? And as as I grow, you know, I've been in the game about 20 years almost, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Became a father, yeah. business owner, you know what I mean? Just looking at the evidence of certain theories, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? It was it was time for me to shift 
focus, you know what I mean? I feel like we hold a lot of frustration, a lot of stress, a lot of anger, and that poison the person that's carrying that around, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So I believe that we have to have a healthy way to fight. You know what I mean? A way that don't poison us while we pushing and fighting for justice and, you know, changing our lives for the better. Mm -hmm. And so for me, I found out holistic health is a, is a great way to, to balance that energy. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, and so that the workout came out of just my everyday lifestyle, mm -hmm. how I learned how to manage stress through training. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And. Uh, you know, I became a, a certified long distance running coach mm -hmm. and just, you know what I mean, just that balance, you know, where I know I could do some qigong, I can That's meditate, right. you know what I mean, I can eat certain things and I won't have this issue. I put down the liquor, mm -hmm. put down the, even the weed, you know what I mean, I ain't got nothing against weed per yeah. se, but for me, I just knew I had to uh, have self-control. Exactly. Uh, enough to grow and you know like that so the workout i call it fit hop music yeah you know what i mean the combination of of, of training music and and our hip-hop culture mm -hmm. uh holistic wellness and and uh working on uh workout two now as well so it's been good man yeah. debut number one on apple itunes on the fitness charts that's cold and um yeah i've been traveling and performing and i mean what yeah. is it like performing the workout album though Turned up, man. You lose a few <laughs> calories. Exactly.